In this video, I will show you how to fix Steam Cloud Sync error. If you do have any questions or comments regarding this tutorial, feel free to drop that down in the comment section below the video. And with that being said, let's jump straight into it. So there's a couple of things I'm gonna go through with you today in order to try and fix this problem. Now, the first thing you're gonna to want to do, as you can see, I'm logged in here on the Steam app. Just to note, the steps are the same if you do prefer to use the web-based version of Steam. So the first thing you're gonna to want to make sure is that Steam Cloud is enabled. To check this, once you're logged in, you wanna come up to the top left-hand corner and click onto Steam up here. Next, come down and click onto Settings. And from this window, you wanna to come to the left-hand side and on this menu, you're gonna see Cloud. So go ahead and give that a click. And what you want to do from here is make sure that the switch for this one where it says Enable Steam Cloud, as you can see, Enable Steam Cloud Synchronization for applications which support it. So you wanna make sure this is turned on first of all. Once that's done, go ahead and try to load the game that you were experiencing problems on and see if that does resolve your issue. So if that did not work for you, the next thing you're going to want to do is actually check the Steam server status. Because if the Steam servers are down, that can cause problems with the Steam cloud synchronization. So to do that, what you're going to want to do is open up a new internet browser. And what you want to do is come across to the following website, which is steamstat.us. So this is gonna give you information on all servers all around the world. So you wanna come across to here and see if any of the servers are down. If there's any problems, that's going to be noted here. And of course, if that's the case, you'll just need to wait until these servers are back up and running. If there's any maintenance work going on or something like that, then what you can do is try to launch a game again and see if that fixes the problem. So if after checking out that, that did not work for you, the next thing I would recommend is to completely exit out of Steam and just go ahead and restart Steam. So to do that, what you're gonna to want to do is come back to your desktop. And then if you come down to your taskbar at the bottom, right click, and you wanna go ahead and open up your task manager. From here, what you need to do is go ahead and locate Steam. So you just wanna go through and locate this in the processes section. So you can see the processes tab at the top. You just wanna scroll down until you get to S and then you should see Steam. So you can see we've got Steam here and also the client service. So what you wanna do is go ahead and end the task for both of these. And once that's done, you can go ahead and relaunch Steam on your computer and then try to load up the game again and see if that does resolve this problem. So next, what I would recommend if that did not work is actually verifying the integrity of the game files. So sometimes this error can be caused if there's any files that have become corrupted or damaged. To go ahead and do that, what you're going to want to do is come up to the top left hand corner and click onto library to come to your games library. Next, go and find the game that you're having problems with. So in this example, I'm just gonna go ahead and click onto this game here. And then what you wanna do is actually right click onto the game and it's gonna bring up a menu and then you wanna come down and click onto properties. From this window that comes up, you wanna to come to this menu on the left-hand side and click onto installed files. Then what you need to do is click this button here where it says verify integrity of game files. So it just takes a minute or two to run through and complete, but it's gonna basically check if there's any corrupted or damaged files and attempt to repair them if it's needed. As you can see, all 374 files for this game were successfully validated. So we know that there's no problems with the actual game files. So the final fix you can try is to go ahead and try repairing the Steam folder because in addition to problems with the game files, it could actually be a problem with some files on the actual Steam application. So to do that, what you're gonna to want to do is come up to the top left-hand corner and click onto the Steam icon up here, then come down and click onto settings. From here, what you're gonna to want to do is come to this menu on the left-hand side and you wanna go ahead and click onto storage. And that's going to take you to a screen like this. Now on this bar at the top, if you look to the right, we've got these three dots. If you go ahead and click onto this and what you're going to want to do is click the option which says repair library. Once that's done, what I would recommend doing is completely restarting your PC and hopefully one of these methods should fix the cloud sync error. So I hope this tutorial did help you out today and if this did help you out, I would really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like and also subscribing to the channel. With that being said, I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial and I will see you in the next video.